It took a while to find Neil, really, but we finally tracked him down in Windsor, Ontario. Honestly, like, I go speak at universities and stuff, and the first question everyone asks, where's Wheels? Well, that's my own little scheme to keep myself popular. I just have to disappear for a couple years, and then everybody wonders where I am. Yeah. <laughs> Did you ever get sick of Wheels? Yes. I think I needed time away from Wheels and just period away from acting. This baby's going to take me all the way out west. Do you think there's a little bit of wheels in Neil? Definitely. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, you, you can't help it. I mean, when you play the same guy for, you know, for 10 years yeah. to help picking up some of his traits and, right. you know, he ends up picking some of your traits. Yeah. And... When your father died in real life. Yeah. What happened next? I mean. Yeah. The next thing when wheels, both his parents were killed. Yeah. Yeah. It's been an accident. We're dead. No. Grant us now the con. Were you, were you cool with that? Or? I was very excited about it. I thought it because what I was going through was different than what Wheels went through. You know, he was very angry, very upset. Um, where I was obviously sad, you know, yeah. was, you know, losing my father. Grant us now the confidence of a certain faith. When I was acting, when I was doing the show, I was thinking in the back of my mind, I just want to be a normal person again. I just want to, you know, I just want to work a nine to five job, do my Monday to Friday, do my 40 hours and go home. Jesus Christ, so that's what I did. I uh, worked in everything, you know, I worked in customer service for Money Mart, I, I worked uh, customer service for Pizza Pizza at the call center. Um, I've done construction jobs, landscaping jobs, shipping and receiving jobs. I got my forklift license, and I can operate a boom lift. So I've done all that, now I'm like, now I want to go back to the good money. It was a difficult transition. I wasn't in the limelight anymore. No matter who you are, you're going to miss it. You're going to miss it. The paychecks weren't as good. I, you know, I found that I was having, starting to have financial situations and things of that sort, which I had never gone through before. 
So it was, it was a little difficult changing from Superman into Clark Kent. Would you have liked it if the show had gone longer? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think my, since, since after the show, I think my life, if it would have gone, gone on for a couple more years, I would have matured a little bit more. Mm -hmm. um, and my life would be a little differently than it is now. Mm -hmm. I think more on a positive note. Yeah. But I'm not saying that I don't like my life now. It just, yeah. I, think, I think it just would have been beneficial for, uh, for another season or two. Yeah. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, Linda. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we were in the zoo, Remedy. Yeah. You had to bring that up, didn't you? Everybody get ready and get into gear. I hated every scene that we had to shoot for that. The one and only the remedy is here. It was painful. It, <laughs> it was. It literally hurt. Everybody wants something. How does it go? Okay. You're not getting that from me, Mike. Everybody wants something. They'll never give up. Everybody, Everybody wants something. something. They'll take your money and never give up. Sorry, Stefan, I had to do it. <laughs> I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry.